Okay, here we go. We've finished the uh, installation of server. So, um, anyway, so I'm going to start localhost because I installed this server on localhost. In, and you will see that um, right away, oh, I don't want to do that. Right away, the um, FME server says, would you like to activate FME server? So, again, we're not using a FlexLM, but we're going to have exactly the same capabilities. So I'm going to say yes. And now it immediately goes to this licensing page. And it says FME server is unlicensed. Now to request a new license, I simply click here. I have a machine key. And um, something to know about this machine key, it, we now calculate this using a special, some secret sauce. It's no longer tied to MAC address or anything like that. And this machine key has been created in such a way that it's compatible with technologies like virtual machines, Docker, and uh, things like that. So there you go. So I simply say OK. Um, you'll notice that this is going to use automatic, so it's just going to simply license via the internet. If that wouldn't work, maybe I'm in a proxy. Um, it should work in proxies, but maybe I'm in a disconnected situation or it hasn't um, succeeded for various reasons. But, um, then there is a manual approach as well, which would be you would email us a file. But for here, I'm just going to demo the, um, the eval. So I simply click OK. And now you'll see um, it uh, doing its thing. And it takes about uh, you know under 10 seconds. And uh, the server is licensed and uh, ready to go. So, um, so this is pretty exciting. So there you go. And you can see that I, this is an eval, two engines. There's my machine key. And this is when it expires. So today's the 11th, so I got, I got seven days. Okay, so now if I go to my email over here, um, extended evaluation license, if I simply click this link, now I validated my email. And so I'm going to get a extended um, FME. Now the text in here isn't quite right now, but it gives you the idea. Again, if I was manual, I would download it, but I'm not. So it's simply so what I need to do now is I simply go back to my server and I click this refresh button, refresh license, and the text will tell you that. And then watch what happens and then watch the date on the expires. I click, click, click simply click refresh. And now the date, it's as quick as that, a few seconds, and now my date is I've got it for a month. Okay, so now if um a client buys what they would do, they would simply click here, enter their serial number here, click OK, and then they would have their full-blown um, license. So, uh, so that's it. Um, that's the licensing. We still sell by engines, and but the exciting thing is, is a we get rid of um, FlexLM, b distributed or fault-tolerant distributions just work. There's nothing else you need to do. Um, and see, it uh, gives us the opportunity to have really new and exciting license models for FME Server. And um, indeed, in FME 2017, we will look at different license models for um, FME Desktop as well. So in, initially, out of the gate, there's no change to how we sell or license FME. Only the underlying technology has changed. So there you go.